Hi again, thank you for joining me for another reflection from the Psalms. And so it is, we reach Psalm 91. Psalm 91 has become a, a, an oft-repeated psalm during these coronavirus days. Whoever dwells in the shelter of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, he is my refuge and my fortress, my God in whom I trust. Surely he will save you from the fowler's snare and from the deadly pestilence. And so it goes on. There's a great claim in this psalm that those who walk closely with God, those who acknowledge the majesty of God, will be safe from things like coronavirus. At least that's the claim that's being uh, put around social media at the moment. But of course, in one sense, we know that's not true. Harm does uh, befall us. A disaster does overcome. Uh, we are as susceptible to uh, contracting things like COVID uh, as anybody else and to suffer the um, consequences of that in the same way that any other mortal human being does. We must not be flippant about using psalms like this uh, and uh, certainly never ever throw them at other people as uh, in, in an accusatory way that I think sometimes uh, can be the way that we can come across. But we can cling hold to the eternal perspective that is conveyed in this psalm and of course throughout the whole of scripture, not least in the New Testament through the work of Jesus Christ. We need not fear the terror of night nor the arrow that flies by day because we have a salvation. Uh, he will command his angels concerning you to guard you in all your ways. They will lift you up in their hands. Yeah, that's true. Perhaps not in this life, but certainly in an eternal one. And I love the way that the psalm finishes. Because he loves me, says the Lord, I will rescue him. I will protect him, for he acknowledges my name. He will call on me, and I will answer him. I will be with him in trouble, I will deliver him and honour him. With long life I will satisfy him and show him my salvation. So there is a sense that we have a long or at least a good life on this earth. But then we have the promise of eternal salvation. May that bring comfort to all of us uh, as we rely upon the shelter of the Most High, the shadow of his wing that we can always, always fall under. Let's pray together. Thank you, Father, for your protection and your love. Thank you that even in the midst of huge crises and disasters, when harm is closing in on us, thank you that you are closer still. Keep us safe, keep us well, and keep us in relationship with you through Jesus, I pray. Amen. God bless you. Thank you for joining me and uh, may the, the uh, Psalms bring great comfort to us all. See you again soon. Bye bye.